<sighs> well, hello there, and welcome back to the most polished game in fucking history. <sighs> Common Sense came out, and straight off the bat, I noticed that uh, this is more of a fucking rainbow than it was before. Holy shit, what did they add? Wow. So many, so many good stuff. Amazing. Anyway, we're uh, going to be playing as Tuscany by far. The favorite, my most favorite country uh, in this game. Ever since the game came out, I decided to load up a game as Tuscany, and well, I was not disappointed. They have a uh, tech cost and idea cost reduction. They've got cheaper mercs, which, uh, well, you know how much I like mercs. They've got interest per annum, and straight off, like, these first three ideas are pretty freaking amazing. And then we get uh, yearly prestige, which is fucking amazing. We get more money to buy more mercs with. We get even more money. And then we get some uh, manpower modifier, which is really good. We get discipline. Which I just... There is no way that Tuscany... This is the best country ever. Also, it's a republic. And you start with this badass ruler. A 655. He's pretty old, though. He's gonna die pretty fast, but... Uh, yeah. This is a pretty freaking OP nation. Um, I don't have any really specific goals. I believe uh, Genua is an end node now, so... We're gonna try to uh, get control of uh, Venice, Genua, and the English Channel, of course. Um, that's going to uh, give us an achievement. And there's plenty more achievements, probably. I don't know if we're going to get all of them, but uh, I think not. But uh, we'll just play around with this. Let's check the HRE map real quick. Yeah, we are part of the HRE. Uh, so it's pretty good times. Anyway, let's jump right in here and get going. Also, all of my save files have totally been deleted, which is uh, pretty good stuff. <sighs> we're going to name this Exquisite. Insanity. There you go. I am so excited for this. Holy shit. Also, it looks like Burgundy took a... Took a big hit from the nerf bat. Actually, did they? Let's check real quick. Yeah, they probably did. Are you telling me he doesn't have any forts there? Wow. Now, uh, ooh, this looks totally different. Also, my UI is different now because, uh, you know, pretty cool stuff. Now, declare statute and restraint of appeals. I don't think we want to be doing that. That's going to ruin my papal influence through the max. Also, I like how they made Roma new. Also, wow, wow. So many new buttons. Can I close this? Thank you very much. Okay. Well, straight off the bat, let's pick ourselves a mission. No, let's set rivals first. We definitely want to rival Urbino. Is Urbino part of the HRE now? No, it's still not part of the HRE. It's also a lot smaller. Yeah, I... Uh, oh, I can't rival Urbino. What's this? Are you just too small? Yeah, it's just too small. Wow. Okay. Um... Let's see here. I think we want to be rivaling you, Sienna, and, uh, well, Luca, probably. Is it Luca an important center of trade? Oh, I am! Oh, wow. Oh, that is, okay. Oh, that's nice. And, uh, see here, let's see here. Nigeria has been split in two. That's pretty cool. It's gonna make it harder for me to gain this, uh, whoa, important center of trade. That was definitely a fly. Oh, a real big one, too. Wow. Uh. Tuscany gets foreign contacts until... Plus one dip rep. Uh, it doesn't give points anymore? Oh, wow. Hmm. I think I'll definitely be wanting to pick that mission, though. 
plus one dip rep is uh, not the greatest of things. Also, straight off the bat, we're going to boost stab. Because uh, we're a republic right now, and our republican tradition is not going to stay at 100. Oh, uh, who to rival? Who to rival? Possibly the Pope. I think that might be a good idea. Now, let's check France. Do we want to get an alliance? No, 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 no. Can I royal marriage you? Probably not. Oh, wait, what? No, our government form doesn't allow it. Okay. Well, let's uh, become buddy buddy with France. I think that'd be a good idea. Other than that, uh, we'll get ourselves a leader. I don't want to make my god king into a general. Seems like a bad idea. And, uh,. Let's check which one of these is the best. Seeing as 20 total development, and that has 14. Let's go ahead and uh, fabricate a claim on Sienna. It's probably going to piss people off if we get caught. How much money are we? What is that? We are making so much money. Holy shit. Oh, man. That is. I can I can get a diplo rep, dude. That might be useful at the start of the game. We're gonna go, go pick that guy up now. What else do we need to do? Well, we need to build some infantry, but we don't really have the money for that. Uh, you can go protect trade in Genoa. That's fine. And the rest of these ships are more or less useless to me. Okay, let's go. No sense uh, not jumping right into this. Also, the game speed is... Well, let's not judge anything at the start of the game. It might need some... Uh... It might need to, to, to roll up some steam here. Remember, the money you think you're making isn't what you're making. Check your income in the money tab. Oh, wait, what? Okay... Let's lower that a bit. Oh wow, that okay. Well, let's just lower army maintenance straight off because we don't even want to do any of that. Now, alliance, you want get gimme? Maybe that diplo rep thing wasn't such a bad idea. We can't do the improved relations trick anymore. Oh, Friesland is now a. Uh, Free city, what do you know? Who was this? Kingdom of Italy and Empire. For years now, Imperial authority over the Kingdom of Italy has been waning since so such emperors have failed to impose their will on the. Blah, blah, blah. Formerly part of the Empire has been lost to Venice and the Papal States who reject the Empire's right to them, unless Northern Italy is brought firmly back into the Empire, the states may slip out of control forever. Okay. But I get a choice. You get a choice if you want to stay or leave. And I can just say, uh, let me stay. Also, do we get, uh, like, an Imperial... Is that thing gone? Yes, it's gone. Okay. Don't know if I want to set our focus on something different. Don't think so. No missions give uh, Imperial authority? I mean, uh, points anymore? Okay. Well, I really do wonder where you're going to get the points from to do the stuff that you want to do. But... Yeah. Seems pretty cool. <sighs> Not exactly doing anything. I think we're going to raise maintenance, though. The Sienna fellow has to die. I'm pretty sure we can beat him with our 9,000 guys. Don't really want to be taken alone straight off the bat. Actually, fuck that. We are going to take a load straight off the bat. Yeah, we're going to build two more units because I don't know how expensive this is going to be, so. Let's just go right on ahead. Could rulers of luck, yeah. Has there, have there been some changes to Italy in this patch? Yes, there have. A lot. <laughs> Due to uh, forts. 
Well, okay. It is mostly different. That was a cool sound. I want more sound. There you go. Hey, so we got a claim on Sienna. Um, they don't have any allies. I say let's go. Uh, gonna be arriving on the rest, so on the 19th. Oh, wow, of course you can't change direction anymore. Ha ha ha. So now I'm forced to walk into this. That's uh, pretty sick. I uh, probably can't sort here because I don't have a fort. Oh, I can mothball this fort, right? Yeah, look at that. I don't want to. I don't. I don't want that fort. Hey, so how many guys do we need? We need um, three regiments. So let's get those three regiments in there. Actually, we can just do this. We'll leave uh, we'll leave four regiments in there. And then those other ones can go, uh, let's not pay for those. Just one fort in capital or do you have more? No, just one fort in the capital. That's pretty much it. Now, is there anyone that loves us? Not really. They're all kind of neutral to us. Uh, we can improve relations with Austria as well. I think that'd be a good idea. <sighs> Before you go to war with Genoa, if you do, keep in mind that the, the war with Crimea, they win. Okay. Oh, my troops won't siege properly? That's kind of terrible. It's just common sense, yeah. I want more stability, I think. Stabbing up is really weird when you're, uh... <clears throat> when you're a re republic. Having a beta player in your uh, back pocket helps, yeah. Certainly. Okay. Well, let's just see what happens. I do believe they uh, increased aggressive expansion again, so ooh, this, this is a bad one. But I'll see him acquitted. We are at 100 uh, Republican tradition anyway. Uh, usually, if you count, you, it's better to uh, to lose those points and then just re-elect your leader. That's um, better because if you uh, re-elect your leaders all the time, then you can get you can get more points out of that. You make a profit. Not straight away, but in the long term, you make a profit in terms of points by uh, by pressing that uh, pressing that other button that makes you lose forty points because you lose uh, so you gain ten points in every category, so you lose thirty five points. But you can uh, you can re-elect your leader one more time than you would have been able to, so you can you know you make money using that. That's good mean points. But if you had a hundred it really doesn't matter. 
Okay, so we've breached the walls. Mm, we may try assaulting then. See how, how good that goes. Well, no, let's not. Well, I kind of want to know. I believe anywhere under 50 you can get hit by a dictatorship. Or not 40 now, or it might be 60 or 50, can't remember. Okay. Well, we'll find out. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we'll find out. Now let's check this beautiful cost. Okay, so Sienna. Let's take it down, ask for all of their money, which you can do now. Uh, apparently I can also humiliate them. So that's good. And it actually gave me the points. That's pretty damn good. Now, how expensive would this be? Oh, return province? Oh, wow. Let's not do that. So expensive. <clears throat> and we're gonna raise autonomy there as well, because, uh, you know, yellow swag. Now, let's check how much aggressive expansion we got out of that. Yeah, we can do that joke again. So uh, let's go ahead and do the same thing to Luca. And did I get a new fort? No, I didn't. I just have the fort here. But, uh, we can repay our loans, and we don't need to be paying for our troops right now, so let's not. Now, yeah, lawful territory is quite shit. Gonna go ahead and say no to that. And let's keep improving relations with France. Flory, can I be an ass to Lyle? What? what? You can, but... Why? AI de decreases slower? Uh, let me just check. No, it doesn't. Holy shit, it definitely does not. Plus two yearly, that's... That's pretty good. This guy's hostile to me. That's not good. Really be needing this alliance right about now. After this province is finished goring, we can uh, we can go get that alliance. But first of all, let's set ourselves a new rival. Um, Ferrera is pretty close, so I'm thinking we want to set Ferrera as a rival. Yeah. Can I charge Emily for oxygen? <laughs> Guys, please don't fight in the chat. There's a uh, there's more than enough drama in the stream as it is from uh, from just me. Also, I can up this, but I don't really see the point in doing that right now. I do believe we can get plenty of discounts, so we, there's really no reason for me to do any of that. What are the parameters and objectives for this playthrough? Well, there is an achievement that you can get if you have full control over Genua, uh, Venice, and the English Channel, so we're going to be doing that. You can get royal marriage with France. No, because I'm a republic, I cannot. It says I can, but uh, definitely cannot. Our government form does not allow royal marriages. Bet my drama llama. <laughs> right, when's this finished? Okay. Did you get any allies? You didn't get any allies. I really don't see the point in not attacking him right now. We're almost back to the size that Tuscany is supposed to be. <sighs> Tuscany. What a glorious nation. Right, maybe we can get this alliance now. Uh, we're close. Definitely close. So I do believe it disbanded some of my units. Yeah, I think it did. Not sure though. 
<laughs> Always an excuse. Can't get a royal marriage because I'm a republic. Can't do it because I'm Jewish. <laughs> but it's true though. Alright, we'll send those to uh, Genua. It seems like a great plan. Now come on, France. You really should be wanting to accept this. There you go. Okay, so we're pretty safe now. We're pretty good to go. That's nice. This guy still wants my vagina. No, not really. But we can improve relations with him until he would. And uh, I don't believe our guy got caught just now. So, uh... No real reason not to attack this right now. Am I going to catch him? I am. Did I get a leader? Yeah, I did. He's like really shit. Doesn't really matter though. Oh shit. This guy's gonna get destroyed. Well, sort of. Let's go mothball him. And, uh, well, since we're f gonna be forced to pay for our troops. Might as well just leave three guys in there and then just bail. Miles being dumb and racist. Guys, if you don't stop fighting, I'm gonna... Oh. What's that? Give me the prestige. If you guys don't stop fighting, I'm gonna unmod and ban both of you. So, uh, you better get along. Alright, so down the drain you go. <laughs> now, any other big alliances we would like to get? So this looks completely different, and no more square mammal. Fantastic. Uh, well, maybe Poland would be a good idea. Also, putting our troops in Siena might not be uh, the most stupid of ideas. I do believe there's quite a bit of revolt risk there. And which two friendly troops reduce it? Negative two. And they renamed it the Separatism. Perfect. That is so much better than nationalism in so many ways. That is really good. I am I am proud, Paradox. I am proud. Goodness, you guys need a mob moderator. <laughs> what a ooh, yeah, we're definitely keeping him. He's just too good. Um what achievement am I going for? I am going for the achievement to control Venice, Genua, and uh the English Channel. Why are my guys reinforcing? I definitely have army maintenance up. Makes uh, very little sense to me, but... I may have just fucked up and I didn't notice. That could be a... It could be a thing. What's up, dude? Oh, nothing much. Just playing, uh, well, nothing much. I'm playing the greatest expansion ever. <sighs> Pretty happy about that. So let's check this out. Seven free cities. Twenty-five needed to maintain legitimacy. Imperial authority increases by twenty-two every month. Okay. What do I need to form Italy? Still changes to um to a republic. I mean to a monarchy. Sadly, government rank changes to kingdom. Okay. Owns Roma, Ancona, Mantua, Verona, Modena, Milan, and Genua. Well, they said there were additional requirements, but.
Don't really know. Yeah, I don't know, guys. Just fucking knock it off or something. <laughs> can get another leader, but my leaders are just genuinely crap, so that will be a uh, kind of a waste of military points. Oh, more Diplotech. Glorious. Can I save up more power? I can't. I think I want to set this on Atman. Oh, wait, what? Hmm. Oh, well, phone. Stop it. Hey, well, I can piece out another thing. How close are you to accepting an alliance? Uh, not in the slightest. Well, let's go ahead and siege this place up. I mean, get all their money. And uh, humiliate them, apparently. I feel like this is kind of stupid. Like, how can you humiliate someone when you full annex them? That's... I mean, I like it, because it gives me power projection points. But how can I have 100? That's weird. But I mean, sure, I'll take it. And we'll increase autonomy here. Now, I think I want to be having this fort activated. Otherwise, shit's going to hit the fan when the rebellion pops. And I need all of my guys in uh, Sienna. So what happened to my force limit? It increased by two points. I think I'll be wanting some cav. And about those ships, I can add another one as well. Now, it's once again... Check this aggressive expansion. I think we can get away with uh, stealing an Urbino. Oh, you're a vassal of the Papal State. Ooh, well, what do you know? Who are you allied with? Hungary, England, and Milan. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Don't know about them apples. Who are you allied with? Savoy. Now, that is an apple I would like to get. So, uh, let me just go ahead and fabricate a claim on that guy. If our guy gets caught, that wouldn't be the end of the world. Yeah. Don't see that happening anytime soon. I could continue to improve relations with him, though, but I don't think we can get that Austrian alliance. I figured we wouldn't be able to, but... Genua is definitely allied to Austria. That's nice. And France is my ally. Uh... Who else you allied with? Who did you rival? Okay. Oh, I would like to get something of a different ally. Maybe, um... Maybe Aragon. Yeah, maybe Ar Aragon might be a good idea. Just for now. Don't worry, is the paper see a threat? Um, uh, not really. Also, Gen Genua, who are you? Oh, you're at war with Tusk and uh, Savoy. There you go. I bet you can't, a Mott Lyle. Oh, God, guys, honestly. Florian, remember you don't need to siege the to you don't need to siege any provinces next to your fort as long as they're not also next to a fort. Your zone of control will do it for you. Okay. Yeah, the Pope isn't really a threat, but they're allied to Milan, and I don't think France would join because France is. Uh, I don't know what France is doing. It looked like they were at war, but they definitely aren't. They're just sitting there. Oh, it's because I saw all those 
miners walking around, they might join that war against the Pope. Yeah, I would like to kill the Pope. Not completely, though. I just want to take his uh, non-Pope provinces. Ah, France wants me to join a war against the Pope. We will join that war, but uh, hold on to your horses here. Let's head over to Tech 4. These, Tuscany is the first one to head Tech 4, no matter what they do. So, uh, pretty good on that. Now, I would like to join that, but first things first, I need to get a claim on the Pope. Uh, I want to claim the biggest province. Let's see, 5869. Yeah. Let's go ahead and claim Umbria. Also going to get this guy home, and we're going to claim Urbino as well. And now I'll accept this war. So now we're at war with the Pope. He does have more guys than we do, but our guys are better because they have a, a tactics and morale bonus. So we can probably just go about attacking him. Now, let's see, ninth. Umbria on the 9th. Let's see what he's going to do. We're not going to catch him. Ah, and because Roma is the fort, we can't walk into Umbria unless we fight the Pope first. And the Pope's gonna go straight for my fort, apparently. Which, uh, you know, that's that's cool. He can go ahead and do that, that's fine. In the meantime, though, we're gonna kick these Urbanese to the, to the face, because I don't see a real reason why not. Now, if I am not mistaken, can I, like, ask access through you? Yeah, I can. I don't know, we'd have to see how that works, though. Okay, let's go kick these uh, these papal bastards in the ass. He is sieging up my province, and I don't really appreciate that. What's his leader? He's a zero, zero 01. We've got a tactics and a morale boost, so this should be a breeze. Sorry, who are your top tier lady heroes? Oh, I don't know. I could have claimed Rome. Yeah, but I don't want Rome. If you take Rome, then you're uh, kind of screwed, aren't you? I need Hungary to piss off here. Oof. Don't want to be doing any of that. I, need, I really need Hungary to piss off there. If you get, uh, I don't know how to answer that though. Hey, right, we can march straight on Rome, I think. Oh, they have a level two fort. Yeah, we need nine regiments for that. So, uh, we need two more of those. I don't know my favorite lady heroes, whatever. Don't know. Uh, yeah, it used to be 33. I'm totally one of them, that is true. You're certainly totally one of them. Top three lady heroes. I don't know. Tons. Hungry and really need you to just shove off. Probably won't attach to me because it's not my war. Yeah. 
Hopefully France will give me Umbria though. <clears throat> I'll laugh my ass off if he gives me uh, something else. Oh wait, he can't give me Umbria. Because I haven't claimed it yet. So if this if I beat Roma before uh, before I can take that before I can finish that claim, we're kinda screwed. And that claim is taking its sweet time. Oh well. <laughs>